breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. See exactly what is happening now. R Wiki Rivers PDP sends strong warning to Atiko as Atiko protests and says this is not right. Uh, Wiki cannot be getting nomination in uh, Tinubu's administration. Says we cannot allow this same thing to happen over and over again. We can't allow such. We can't allow that to happen. So this is what is going on, my lovely people. And every single person is watching to see how these issues will turn out. Anyway, my Nigerians, this is what is happening. And this is why every single individual must ensure that we do the right thing and understand what politicians are doing. So let's get all the details and get what exactly is going on. Wiki says the river PDP has sent a strong warning to Atiku. The Rivers chapter of the People Democratic Party in River State has alleged that the force led by Atiku Abubakar, the presidential candidate of the party in the 2023 election, are plotting against the former governor of the state, Yeson Wiki, over his nomination as a minister by President Bola Ahmed Tinubu. The party claimed it was aware that members of the group led by the former vice president are holding meetings on how to deal with wiki who according to it it's a patron member and a prominent nationalist whose interest is to protect the unity and stability of our country clearly the pdp said this in a statement signed by honorable obona former spokesman of the state campaign organization of the state. The party noted that decisions by Tinubu to nominate Wiki and other prominent Nigerians with proven track record to serve the nation is being halted by progressive-minded Nigerians as a mind stroke on the coming effort to reclaiming the country back. For people like Atiku wants to destroy this very good trend. The current APC government, which is hailed nationwide by the resolution to provide typical Nigerian solution and making sure they tackle with it and bring it to an end, is currently being... So, this is what is going on. And it says people like Tinubu government wants to res resolve beyond words what Nigerians are going through now. But Atiku does not understand that because it's clouded with what he wants to achieve. The gang of Confucianists in PDP will, for self what and selfishness due to pride, wants to destroy the new Nigeria Tinubu is trying to build. Obona added that Wiki, who, according to him, struggled for the rebuilding of PDP before the arrival of the locusts, like people, people like Atiku, the good people of Nigeria fought for justice, equality, and fairness, and nationalists to ensure that Nigeria is safe. The government, headed by Bola Ahmed Tinubu, wants to allow this to become a watchword, and so he's doing everything he possibly can, bringing people from all walks of life, irrespective of party. These are the kind of people that we need as leaders to bring Nigeria to where it needs to be. So nobody should take what belongs to Nigerians and we will fight every one of them to a stand still. So my lovely people, this is what is happening now. And this is why every single one of us needs to understand the place that we are in. Okay, Atiku and uh, Obi at it again. Uh, Atiku and, uh, uh, I beg your pardon, Atiku and, uh, uh, and Wiki. Wiki is being fought for the fact that Tinubu nominated him. But that Tinubu nominated him is not just because Tinubu wanted to nominate him. Many things happened. Wiki fought to ensure, according to him, that, you know, Tinubu gets to where he is with his own little capacity in River State, what he could do to ensure that Tinubu becomes Nigerian president. He did it. We are all aware that you know, they keep telling us that the result in River State was manipulated. It was not the real result that it should be. 
So these are some of the issues and problems that are happening and why none of us should allow the same thing to happen again and again. Okay? Why none of us will allow the same thing to happen? So this is what is happening right now. And every single one of us must understand that Nigeria belongs to us. Okay? So if, if Tinubu said he wants to build you know, a nation, that's not a problem. It's a good thing if he wants to build. Because for a long time, that's the same thing we've been crying about. However, how is he building it? What's this building all about? First of all, we need the court to decide on who is Nigerian's president. INEC have decided, INEC have called a result. But is that enough? Because as we speak, these cases are still in court. You know, the case is still in court and we don't really know who the president is. Yes, he has put together a list of ministers. It's the right thing to do. You can't work in office. Of course, they have a time limit which he has met without having your, your, your support or your backup system. Very good. You should have them. Okay? It makes the work easy so that you can hit the ground and run in. However, it all being said and done, what's the, next, what's, the, what's the next line of action? Are we just going to sit back there and think that all oh, we just fall in place? It doesn't work that way. Whoever gave you that idea is deceiving you. It's really, it's really, you know, it's really deceiving you. So this is what happens. This is what is going on and why we cannot afford to allow the same thing to go on again and again. So Nigerians, it is what it is. It is what it is. And um, if we are going to make a headway and change is going to come, if we're really going to get this nation back on track and begin to work. This is the time to begin to work at it. Okay. So that Nigeria can become the nation she needs to be. There are a lot of people who do not want this country to survive. Oh, you don't know. There are lots of people whose aim and purpose is for themselves and they don't care what happens to other people. They just want to, you know, they just want to, you know, uh, they just want to, you know, have a system where they can, where they can do and undo and they are the ones in charge and every other person is a subordinate. But God pass them. You see now, God pass them. So this is part of what is happening. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Remember that Nigeria will change. And things will get better. And these are the days upon us. And every single one of us must do all we can, humanly speaking, possible to make Nigeria a better place. So at the end of the day, we all can truly live in dignity. And our country, we can restore. And we can restore our country and bring our country back to where it needs to be. If things are going to get better, if things are going to change, if this nation is going to experience the joy of a new day, these are some of the issues that needs to be sorted even now. So nobody should take that from us. Every one of us needs the opportunity for a change. God bless. Bye for now.